Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to discuss the use of functions to remove spaces within strings. I'm going to go over the L trim function and the R trim function. Sometimes when you execute queries, unnecessary spaces are created in the output that you need to remove. The L trim function and the R trim function are used to remove spaces from either the left or right hand side of a string. Let's take a look at a query that concatenates and displays customer's first name, last name, city, and state. So in this query, we're going to select the first name, the last name, the city, and the state from the customer table. And we're going to merge it all together We're using concatenation. Merge it under one column named customer, state, city. So we click execute. And as you can see, we see the first name, the last name, the state and the city, but there are many spaces in between. So commonly when you do concatenation, it does cause extra spaces. So what we want to do is we're going to use our L trim and R trim functions to get rid of all the spaces in the data and have a nice clean look where everything is sitting closer together and displayed under customer state city column. So now we're going to use the L trim and the R trim function to delete all these extra spaces in our output. So the query we used before is above and now we've added the R trim function to the first name column to delete all of the spaces to the right of the first name. So all the values for the first name R trim meaning right trim. And then for our next column, the last name column, we used R trim again because we want to get rid of the all the spaces to the right of the last name. Then we use R trim for the city. And then we use L trim for the state to ensure that we capture these spaces that are to the left of the state but are to the right of the city. So we're going to click execute. And as you can see, it's a much cleaner display. We have John Dittens. He lives in Atlanta, Georgia. And now I want to run both of them so you can see the difference between the code. So this one has all the spaces. And this is a lot cleaner look at the bottom here. I hope you enjoyed learning about the L trim function and the R trim function today. And if you'd like more in-depth learning, please check out my SQL course in the description section below.